I am back. It's time for some Celeste. I need to change my stuff. <laughs> uh, hold up. Boop, 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 boop. I can't remember the name of this level! A quick run of storks. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to Google this. I legitimately can't remember. DLC... Horse list. Farewell. There we go. All right. So we're just finishing this up, and then we'll be back on Grand Pooh World. We're working on it. We're working on it. Let's see. Okay. So, thankfully I didn't have to restart this, but... Um... What were we doing here? What were we doing? I had to get there, and then... I don't think I've gotten past this bounce. Well, I might have. We gotta land on the inside, I think, of that one. Of the, purple, the pink one. And then go on the underside and then jump over. I guess let's just try it and see what happens, you know? Do that, uh, wave dash. Oh, we're probably dead. Yeah. Ah! So... Can we just do that? No. It's <laughs> like genuinely curious if I could do that or not. Hey, Eulers, huh? Yeah. Now that we're not doing the stream or not doing the race, we do doggo cam. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Good old dealers. Yeah. Yeah, I wasn't able to pet her during the race. I mean, like... Is this any different than just, you know? No, we can we get farther this way for sure. I think I'm overthinking this, honestly.
Well, I had it. There was cheese for the ending of that uh, ROM hack race where it didn't you didn't have to do like the two regrams. I'm curious to see like what the cheese was. Oh, mm, cheese, delicious cheese. Being away from work for nine hours doesn't help. Yeah. Right now, my partner and I are on the same schedule, but I mean, like, I am doing this right now, so I'm home, so I can take care of the dog. But yeah, like, when we were both on the same schedule and, like, both have to be at work for, like, eight hours, that really sucked. Like, for sure. I mean, most of your dogs can get used to it, but it's not the greatest scenario, to be honest. But yeah. I mean, the other option is like maybe if you have like a house or something like I know that's not available for everybody, but like a doggy door or something, but it really depends. Well, at that point, you have to, you, you'd you have to definitely, like, um, or, like, crate train your dog. Like, that's what you have to do. And, you know, it's not as, like, detrimental as people, like, oh, my God, you know, it's the worst thing ever. It's like, basically, you're teaching the dog that's their home kind of thing. So that way they don't just, like... You know, go everywhere else. And plus, you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to punish your animal by putting them in the crate. That's not how that works. You're supposed to like give them toys and stuff in there, and actually get a big enough crate for your dog. Don't be. Don't be one of those people. But yeah, some dogs get really like. If you're if you're gone, they get like that uh, separation anxiety. So I'm thinking I have to grab this. I have to keep the the dash. Gosh, the time is better. Hi, yeah. Getting a fat lab and then a border collie. There you go. I mean, there. Hey, that's that's acceptable. I mean, you know. Labs are super energetic. Oh, no. Hi, Eulers. You know? Okay, I'll take this off for you now. Yeah. Let's 
need you to play with your ball and stuff. Yeah. Labs? I mean, my partner's parents have a lab. They have a black lab. And it's like the most energetic dog I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. I'm not even sure how you would train that, like, out of a dog. Separation anxiety? I really don't know. How was the ROM hack race today? It took me four hours. <laughs> like, I just finished it not too long ago. It was hard. <laughs> Fugu. I mean, even Illy gets, you know, a little bit of separation anxiety, because, like, you know, when a partner goes to work, you know, she's kind of sad that she's not hearing that kind of stuff, but I try and keep her entertained. I got a, a giggle ball, but now that means that Kaku must throw it all the time. It is the way. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if all dogs have object permanence or not. Like, I really don't know. I just like the dumb as a sack of potatoes. <laughs> really? I have to wait later, longer, I guess, to hit the jump button here. To go higher. I think maybe your dog lacked object permanence. Which is like... I don't even know how you teach that to a dog. Because that makes sense, because like once you leave... their sight, right? You, it's like you don't exist anymore. That's how streaming works too? I know, right? And he's like, Kaka, where have you been? You've been gone for three years. It's like, dude, I just streamed 12 hours yesterday. What are you talking about? <laughs> Once stream ends, you don't exist anymore. Oh my gosh. That's so sad. Oh, I love dogs. Dogs are great. Oh, 
too late. <sighs> yeah. German Shepherds are super good dogs. Yeah. Almost made that work. Too early. Oh my gosh. I also remember that they like changed the uh the rhythm in this uh in this section from the previous sections. Yeah. The rhythm difference is so is big here. It's much slower. Jumping way too early. Ah! As I've, as I've gotten older, like, I used to like bigger dogs, but, like, now, you know, I prefer smaller dogs now, personally. So, like, for me, like, Lily is, like, perfect size. Yeah. Like, I can understand, like, you know, like, my partner liking a bigger dog. It makes sense, because, you know, she's on the shorter side. Like, you know, bigger dog, more protection, you know, that kind of thing. Like, I get that. I get it. I just like bigger... I like smaller dogs because they're lap dogs, and they're not big dogs trying to be lap dogs. But no, I get it. Like, bigger dogs are also harder to handle. So I get it. Makes sense. How am I getting hit now so much? Oh yeah, if the dog outweighs you, yeah, that's that's a recipe for disaster. Because, yeah, sometimes you will need to control your animal. Um, and it sucks, but... I mean... Like, even if you outweigh a dog, right? Dogs are usually just gonna be, like, pure muscle, you know? So, that's another thing to take into effect, like, into uh, account as well. Fat lab and a border collie. <laughs> I really want like a beagle, a a Boston Terrier. I love Boston Terriers. They're just so ridiculous. They're so extra. 
That and they sound like the Predator. Whenever they're like super happy, so. <laughs> it always makes me laugh. Yeah, come on. I'm not getting that jump I need. Kaku says, hey, let's play Celeste. So we're not playing Kaizo. Play Celeste, literally Kaizo. <laughs> I mean, where I'm at is basically Kaizo. So, I mean... Not surprised. So I have to get a wall boost here to even stand a chance at this. Pressing dash, Kaku. Holy heck. Ugh. I mean, I guess I could, like, go under, but... That also seems... Unnecessary? An Aussie Shepherd? I've seen an Australian Sheepdog. They're... They're adorable. I know at, like, one place I worked before, it was like, the dog is your boss. Dog was my boss. Confirmed. Ugh. You gotta get a farm first, yeah. Oh, I'm bad. Well, we got, um, PB at least.
Lily! What are you barking at? Huh? Oh, I had to go down and hold on that. Okay. And then go over. Okay. Didn't make a bunny farm. I mean, that tracks, though, you know. <laughs> Why not up? Why not up diagonal? I mean, it'd be great to win the lottery, but... Eh, I can't see the point in playing it, to be honest. It's like such a slim chance. Close. It's like astronomically small. They make more bunnies and fast. Yeah, I mean, like... That's fair. <laughs> Crap, I'm doomed. I mean... Well, it almost worked out. So I guess I'll count that as a PB. Nice job! Nice job! <laughs> what am I waiting for? That I'm not truly sure about. Wall boost, come on. No wall boost. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> I mean, I would never be able to own a bunny just because I like dogs. And I know that if bunnies get scared too much, they'll die, so... Like... Yeah, I can't have a bunny. <sighs> really? Okay, I gotta, I gotta let go of a button. I'm being an idiot. I'm being my own special kind of idiot right now. I mean, it's good to know that I can do it that way. It's not definitely not the intended way, but... I know I gotta, like, press it later. To, like, be able to get it. There we go. I did it again. Frick! I cannot use a boost. Cannot use a boost. Rip. Bonk. timing sucks. Or I'm really bad at timing things. I mean that too. Let's be honest. Huh? Okay. No jump? Really? It's like three times in a row. Feels so bad. And then I hit it, but it doesn't matter because I don't have enough. I'm not. I haven't waited long enough to like make that work. I guess like this level makes you dizzy. There's a lot to it. There's so much to this level. And yeah, it doesn't help. There's like a black hole in the background. You know, that doesn't help either.
On the bright side, I'm almost done with this, I guess. So I've been told, like, who knows how much more I've got to go, but... Dash, that's why. That dash spaces it out so it works. Like, I already know this, but like, for some reason, my brain's like, but what if we didn't? But what if. What if we just didn't dash and weren't following the same things we've done that have worked before? I use a dash. Mother Trucker. I just have to grab onto this yellow block without using a dash. That's really all it boils down to. And I basically have it. Mm. What am I doing? feels bad. Alright, available username. Take it easy. Thank you so much for stopping by. Have yourself a good night. Yeah, I'm hoping I can finish this up and then get back on that Grand Poo World grind. That's the plan. Gosh, are you kidding me? What am I supposed to do? So I have to wait so long. <sighs> I mean, I have an idea. It involves like dashing back into the spring, I guess. Did I misspell farewell? Oh, farewell. Farewell. I like it. <laughs> Whatever, I corrected it. Yo, sodium, how you doing? Yeah, I have to, like, dash back into the spring here, I guess.
Oh my gosh. Okay, that's really, really tight. Doing decently? I mean... I feel you. I mean... <laughs> Whatever, it worked. I don't care. I don't care. Finally free from that room. you finally now where's granny oh no are you okay I'm sorry I didn't mean to hurt you wait please don't leave at least tell me you're part of granny right if you have to go then Alright, Nifflim, thank you so much for stopping by. Have yourself a wonderful evening. Take it easy. Take me with you. Madeline, stop. You can't go with her. Shut up. You couldn't force me to give up on the mountain, and you can't force me to give up on Granny. Go away. I'm not forcing you. I'm asking you. I miss Granny, too. She meant a lot to both of us. Then why is it so easy for you to leave her behind? It's not easy. Maybe I pushed us to get over it too quickly, but this isn't healthy either. I just want to survive this. I know she's gone. And this is just a dream. Catching this bird won't bring her back. I'm so sorry, Madeline. Let's wake up, and we'll face this together. No. Not yet. I want to set things right first. What do you mean? The bird. It's trapped here because of me. We need to help it escape before we leave. Granny wouldn't want it to be stuck like this. You're right. Let's do it. But as soon as we're done, we need to wake up. This place is so weird. I want to go home. <sighs> okay. That's really fast.
Just wake up! I wish, yeah, right? Bounce up and then throw it. And then, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. I see this, I see this. I see what we gotta do here. Oh my gosh, okay. Ah! Dang it. You can just land on top of it. I don't know why I'm trying to do crazy stuff. This bird is getting hyper. I don't know why there's like a lot of like generators everywhere, but apparently this is a thing. Oh my gosh. Emancipation grids? I've never heard that term used before. Oh, the jelly destroying fields? Oh, okay. I see you, I see you. Portal reference? It's been so long since I've played Portal. So I have to drop it. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Close. Oh, jeez. Rip Jelly. Rip Jelly Gang. Uh, 
Uh. See you later, Jelly. Oh my gosh, did Jelly survive? Rip. Rip Jelly! Just chucking jellies, you know, as you do. Rip. I mean, I feel like I would have been fine there without doing the up dash. I had to go up. I have to go straight up with that one. Rip. Ah. Come on. Come on, Jelly, work with me. You gotta dash. You gotta the whole. You gotta do the whole dash thing. You know. Nice, nailed it. So finally hit sixty, Hindenburg, huh? You're now free for a whole like two days before the TVC struggle begins. Jeez, Louise. Hell yeah, dude. Let's go. You don't know what to do with yourself now, right? <laughs> You should be grinding levels. Yeah, that's fair.
Yeah, that's fair. Like, if your gear is just better, like, I mean, if you you did Nax, so that makes sense, right? That totally makes sense. You can always start looking at, uh, you know, checking out Final Fantasy XIV if you want. <laughs> you, got, you got two whole days. Two whole days! <sighs> nope. That's not how you do it. Long weekend? Is this a holiday weekend? Oh, it is, right? It's Memorial Day. Oh, yours was last weekend? I mean, that that's fair. Yo, happy big weekend. Heck yeah. Uh, oh, I have to hit it from the right. Hey, uh. Thanks, evil. Thanks, thanks, goth Madeline, for chucking me in there. so lucky on that first time through there. Like, holy heck. Oh, a little bit too late.
That's some risky shit, man. Do I need to get over more here? Can I even do this here? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I get it, I get it, I get it. Yo, Louie, yeah, we're we're almost done, I think. I'm almost done with Celeste. Yo, Louie, how'd you get to be such a god gamer? This is the real question. Today's ROM hack race. I got bodied. <laughs> Yo, good race though, man. Nikes. <laughs> Yo, there isn't a chapter 10. Don't give me that shit. It's fine. I'd be so mad if it's chapter 10. Like, legitimately human. Yeah. I didn't get to see the cheese at the end that people were talking about. I'll have to go watch clips of that. There's not, probably. Not yet, anyways, right? It just skips right over to chapter 11. Until I've done Kaizo before. Oh my god, bird, please! Jelly. Jelly, you gonna do me like that? After all we've been through? Jelly, come back! You can blame it all on me! Jelly, come back! Lily, it's not... I didn't mean you. 
The lolly came over me and, and boot me right when I said that. I didn't mean you, Euro. Oh, sorry about that. <sighs> He'll pet the dog. I can do that. Hey. Oh, you little furball. Oh, you little furby. Yeah. Doggy pets. Yeah, I feel you. Can I just make it over? Like, just getting it? Totally. Alright, screw the, uh, screw the jumping. It's got to be timed out like perfectly for that to work. Creepies is gonna suck. I need to go diagonal. I don't know why I keep like. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Right? Like. Ugh. Ah, too late. Jeez, la heck and wheeze. Zoom, zoom, zoom. These bullfish are definitely cool. How do we do this? I need to do, no, I need to do it once. Okay, now we're good.
why is there a wall there? I guess if you are going fast, you can wait. Yeah, okay, all right, that's fair. Do I have to get on the, like, right side of the little fish? Yeah, I do. Okay, so, like, how am I gonna do that? We almost had it, like... Yeah, J.B. Huber, exactly, yeah, this is pretty ridiculous, honestly. But I mean, like, this is the last thing in the game, so I mean, like, all right, I guess. It's like the last thing in the game I haven't done yet. I mean, like, I'm not getting like all strawberries or anything like that, but I have done A, B, and C sides. Ugh. Don't even do that to me! You're not even the first person to do that! Come on! Come on, chat! Stop telling me this is chapter 10. This game will literally never end. It'll never end! Oh my god! It's a chapter 10, I'm banning so many people in chat. You need special for all the strawberries? I mean, you get like the probably better cutscene, like, with the epilogue. Who said video games were meant to end? Yeah, because the never ending backlog is just a blow up. It's just an absolute nightmare. Ah, I had to go down? I don't know if I trust you. I don't know if I trust anybody anymore. I'm a lone wolf looking for trouble. You can trust me, Cocker. You see this Kappa? That means trust me will take you to wonderful places. Yeah, pain. I don't trust Chad at all. Are you kidding me? Chad's like, jump in the pit! It's a secret exit! <laughs> Streamer doesn't know! <laughs> Come on. Kappa Mountain? That is a real place. <laughs> I just find it funny that that actually is a place. A real place in SMW. Sure. It, it looks to work in such a weird way. I mean... I don't know, we're kind of in like a dream world where like... You know, amoebas and stuff are... All over the place. I guess if this is like the, the line, you know, I get it. Acid trip world. I mean, you're not wrong. Don't do drugs, kids. Ah! Ah! 
The patch of training of a PowerPoint presentation? That means you work in an office. You need to find a new office job. You're dreaming in PowerPoints? You've gone off the deep end. Every time you hear the word line, you're reminded of the hot drinks training video. What? Yo, my car, how you doing? Oh, Wendy's hot drinks? Is this supposedly, is it like a meme video or something? That I probably didn't see. I'm old man Kusha, okay? I don't get none of your newfangled memes. Youngins, get off my lawn. <laughs> it's quite old. You underestimate how old I am, Louie. I'm so old I lost all my hair. Come on. I'm abusing that joke. Shit. It's such a bot. Oh my gosh. Post that in Discord and I'll actually watch it. I'm not gonna watch it right now. I don't wanna I don't wanna get DMCA'd over a Wendy's hot drink video. It seems stupid. This game! Let's, be, let's blame Chris G or Barb. Those are my two go-to targets. Chris G! I mean... That's technically spoilers, JV. We're, we're, I'm pretty sure we're almost there. I've been in this level for freaking ever. I've been in this level forever, let's be honest. I'm pretty- I have to be close. If I'm not close, I don't even know. We're saving the burb. Sick. How did I do in the race? Uh, I'm pretty sure I got dead last. By four seconds. Unheckin' believable. Ugh. I mean, but the, uh... Yeah, Proto Pizza, laugh it up! Unbelievable, beaten by four seconds, we both got about four hours. Three hours, 58 minutes, and we were apart by four seconds. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. The dumbest thing. How? Literally how? No, you weren't Zuccotti, you're lying. This Wendy's hot thing is ridiculous. I haven't even, I haven't even heard of this thing. It's like, it's all the newfangled kid memes. It's like saying drip all the time. I don't get it. I lost my hair. You lost by a hair? Amper Sam, that is so bad.
drip on fleek wiling out yolo bofa yolo drip cash me outside yada -dai. Oh my god, I like- I love just retaining I don't understand anything, it's great. It makes me feel so good. Uh, okay. I like have to boost into that... ...and like jump around it. This is basically machine learning training. I mean, at least I for one will welcome our new robot overlords. I'm pretty sure that's what I'm supposed to do. I'm not 100% sure. Like, I don't know. It to be lower. <laughs> sure. We're getting there. We're getting there. One day. I think I have to like make it go down and then when it's coming up, go across, I guess. Yeah.
Okay, so... I have to use the up boost here. But... Do I have to do a... Do I have to do a wave dash? I actually have like no idea if I have to do a wave dash here or not. This is like the part we have to figure out still, I guess. Oh. Ooh. Come on. I can't just reach it. Or maybe I can. No. Oh, gosh darn it. Ah. Uh, Alright, somebody want to give me a hint for this thing? Because this is getting kind of annoying. I'm not going to lie. For this last part here. Or what I assume is the last part. Do I need to, like... Do I need to boost off that right thing? Or... Like a movement boost off of it, or is it like I have to do like some ghetto stuff? Like I feel like it's I have to do like a boost off the right thing. It's just oh my gosh, it sucks so bad. I guess I could try and do like a down right boost, I guess. Yeah, it's just trying to time it, you know? I guess it shouldn't be too bad. It should be a lot easier than doing the the block boost on the right. For some reason, my brain was like, oh, you gotta hold on to it in order to get the boost. And it's like, no, you don't. physics in this game are a little weird. I guess, yeah. I didn't even think about it. Like, the correct strat is to go off the, or the intended strat was to go off the right block as it was going up. But yeah, I could have just done that. Okay, so we gotta grab the bubble first. The 
it still won't allow us a second hit. does it We don't want it to end. Not doing what I was planning on doing. Oh my gosh, really? Heck you! I think I do have to hit this bubble, like... Do you really have to dash down through that small one tile gap? Are you shitting me? I'm so upset right now. This is garbage. This is so hot garbage if this is the intended strat. This is mega trash. Garbodora, some would call it. I guess I could, like, go up, up instead. I mean, they made Kaizo games. I don't know. There's elements of Kai's on it, for sure. I don't know. This is the this is the Dark Souls of platformers. That's all I'm saying, okay? Oh, we're dead.
Remember when it was really cool for game journals to say that? This is the Dark Souls of puzzle games. This is the Dark Souls of card games. Which is only Yu-Gi-Oh. Only Yu-Gi-Oh can be the Dark Souls of card games. You're literally sending people to the Shadow Realm, which is a PG way to saying that they're dying. Another room! How convenient! <laughs> this is the game that never ends. It goes on and on, my friends. Some people start and playing and not knowing when it ends. But then you get A, B, C, D, E, F, G, sides. This is the game that never ends. Lydia, Yu-Gi-Oh is stupid. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh gets really dumb. Yeah, I'm already playing chapter 10. Like this, this chapter is so long. You just, you just skip, you skip chapter 10. Do not pass go, do not collect $200. Requiring wave vanishes. Still feels bad. In full combo. Jeez Louise. That sounds like Yu-Gi-Oh. That's my Yu-Gi-Oh! I need to wave dash. <sighs> Cocky, you thought you didn't have to wave dash? <laughs> oh, dude. Why didn't I just play Kaizo today? Oh my gosh. Right, yeah, and cards don't cost anything to play. It's just like you're limited to like how many creatures you can play a turn, I guess. Like basic creatures, I suppose. Like if you special summon stuff, it doesn't apply. Yeah, Yu Gi Oh! is very dumb. Yeah, with no, like, mana or, like, energies or anything like that, like Pokemon has, Yu-Gi-Oh! gets wild. Oh. There are you cards in Yu-Gi-Oh! that help you not get killed turn one. Yu-Gi-Oh! sounds hella dumb. I haven't played Yu-Gi-Oh! since, like, the original, the OG. Fifteen times a turn? What the hell? Yu-Gi-Oh! sounds absolutely cracked in half. you wave dash why wouldn't you wave dash hi ya what's up second how you doing gosh dang it 
Leaping lampreys. When in doubt, wave dash. Just always, always be wave dashing. A B W. You had a fun night? Yo, let's go. Yo, glad I'm here. Make any two cards full combo? That's insane. No. No. We have we have so far to go in Grand Prix World. <laughs> I wish, but no. Because I gotta do uh I gotta beat the final vessel, the the castle, right? And I gotta do special world. Let's go. How far did he get last night? I don't think I got any farther than... I'm still on the castle. This game seriously never ends. that jump there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff in grand Prix world you gotta work on music's picking up though yeah the wind feels good for sure there's a house do more Grand Pooh World after this, so. Whenever I finish this game, I'm not sure. The aesthetic for this game is amazing. Like, confirmed, for sure. work that was ridiculous how did that upright dash work <laughs> yo came in I don't know how the hell I got through there without dying Yu-Gi-Oh Yeah, it's basically whoever wins the coin flip wins. That's that's a dumb card game. Oh no, yeah.
if you literally build your deck around going second and surviving the first turn, that sounds like the most insane shit I've ever heard. You're playing Munchkin? I've never played Munchkin. Yo, Dragonfire, how you doing? Oh, am I just dodging this bird? <sighs> this is why I've spent 80 hours on Grand Pool, by the way. I gotta eat glasses. <laughs> Munchkins is silly fun. There's 133 expansions? I can't! I'm not buying 133 expansions. That's nightmarish. Yo, nice. Yo, what's up, Twig? Yeah, typical cocky stream. Been a long day. I spent four hours on the ROM hack race, Twig. My brain is dead. Interesting, Zakani. Yeah, it's, it's really good, too, because we're going to go play the Grand Pooh World after this. Solid. You solid choice. I mean, like... <laughs> I like my strat better. Yeah, I know, right? I Right, Jamie? I, right? That's what I'm saying. This strat is booty butt cheeks. Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do. Am I really supposed to freaking wave dash off this stupid fish? Seriously? Of course I am. Of course I am. Because why not? If you can wait, you can wave dash it. You can do it. Actually, I don't even think you need to wave dash. It gives you an extra jump. You're worried for your friends? I'm worried for the bird. Oh my god. 
No, there's... No, I hope not. That's fine. That works. No, I'm just... I'm an idiot. I'm overthinking stuff again. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about me. Don't mind me. Don't mind the streamer. Don't listen to me. I'm just doing... I'm just doing shit. All right? I'm wor Look at commas. Look at Twig. This is why this is important. All right? Commas are important. Right? Let's eat grandpa versus... Let's eat grandpa. Very important, okay? One is cannibalism, and one is like, hey, grandpa, food's ready. Like, come on. <laughs> you does not equal your? Look it. Look it, I will turn this bus around, all right? I will turn this bus around. Am I supposed to? It's fine, don't worry about it. Don't worry about my sanity. I'm sure it's not all there, but don't worry about it. We're getting there. <laughs> I don't even know if playing Grand Poo World is a good idea today. I'm gonna be honest with you. My brain is toast, apparently. Shit. Oh my god, it's probably a... Today's probably just a wash. <laughs> right? Well, those, those are butthole tests. Have you ever given kids the test? Heck that, that's, that's so dumb. I hate those tests. Like, who goes through a test? Who has enough time on a test to literally go through the test and look at every single question without answering anything? Who does that? What does that do for you? I don't get it. Shit's whack. Oh, read all the questions. Read the instructions, sure. But like, don't like, oh, you need to read every single question. <laughs> you know, like, come on, that's so dumb. But no, teachers that give that test are buttholes. Duck, duck. No thanks. Or you just like you're supposed to just like flip it over and you got like people acting like a chicken and stuff in chat or not uh, in class in chat. Well, I mean that's true, but that's not the point. Quack, quack. Well, I mean, all you have to do is, if you make a test open book, is make it so the questions aren't in order. So that way, for like them to, for somebody, if you use the book on every question, you will fail, because you will run out of time. But if like, you only have to use it a couple times, that's fine. I think that's how it should be, but. You notice you had 15 minutes left and a ton of, a lot of bubbles still not filled in. So you quickly filled in the rest of the test sheet with random bubble answers and you turned the page and saw there was only like three more questions anyways. Then you tried to erase all the bubbles. <laughs> that sucks. Yo, rip dude. That's a blow up. 
It's like, but then like, like when I took the SATs, right? You were actually penalized for guessing incorrectly. So like, if you didn't know something and you got a question wrong, they actually took points away from you. So it's like, some tests are like, basically tell you don't guess, right? Oh my gosh. I mean, if you're a teacher, why can't you do that? I mean, except for like, except for like, you know, state regulated curriculum. Oh, we can't do that. <sighs> that's funny though. That's, that's funny. <laughs> so you, did your teacher ask you like why, uh, why you had like <laughs> an extra 20 questions bubbled in? Well, I think the whole teaching to a test thing in general is very dumb. Personally. Exactly. You Teaching to a test doesn't teach anybody anything. Like, it really doesn't. It doesn't teach you anything. It teaches you to cram information and then forget. Okay. It's not gonna even... <laughs> I didn't even get anything for doing a wave dash there. Well, yeah. It's like in college, I took anatomy and physiology over the summer, so it was an it was an, it was a sixteen week class condensed into an eight week class. Probably the biggest mistake of my life. I'm not gonna lie. If you've ever spent seven hours a day in school and then go home, and then literally do homework all day, like trying to memorize like 250, like every single muscle in the human body in, in one week. hi ya! That was stupid. I don't remember crap from that class, let me be honest. That was basically cram and forget. And with like the, uh, and it's really stupid. <sighs> oh, don't it. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get off this tangent. I'm gonna get off this tangent. I, the rules, the rules for nursing students are so stupid. Like here, okay, I'm just gonna say it. I'm gonna say it because it makes me, it makes me so mad. If you get, if you get a C in a class, a nursing prereq, you're screwed, right? Makes sense. If you fail a class, you can retake it. Only if you fail. If you get a B or a C, you're screwed. Good system. So basically, if you, if you don't get an A, you literally beg the professor to fail you. Stupidest system I've ever heard of. I just keep me hydrated. Is finding a good history teacher that's like the big thing and not just like oh read chapter 11 
and then we'll talk about who did what tomorrow. Like, has like no intention of trying to make history like entertaining at all. Or like trying to get the class involved in like a discussion about like why things were the way they were. Like I remember we had, I had a history teacher that basically like taught that like, you know, like in World War One, right? You know, who was, who was responsible for starting the war? And you can, the way it played out, you could argue a lot of things. You really could. Because, I mean, there was, like, there was, because, like, you know, it was, like, Austria and Germany or whatever, Germany. Like, you can't just mobilize your army on one border, right? So, Russia, they can't watch their, mobilize their army on just one border. You get, I mean, you gotta do the whole thing or not, right? And then that's an act of war against Austria, you know? So, it's, like, worksheets and watch videos? That's lame. Well, it's more than that, though. It's, it's one of the main reasons, yeah. Oh my god, we're almost free. Your dad wanted to name you Ferdinand? <laughs> this is it, we're almost out of here. Let's do this. For granny. For granny! <laughs> What's up, Star? When the game tells you, you know you're close. Oh boy. Oh boy! Ah, oh, it just keeps going! Oh, cool! Are we fucking kidding? It's just so stupid. Oh my god. Uh, okay. Doesn't even matter. The stage is like all the seats were occupied. <laughs> throw it over, burn through, up, boost. Cool, up, boost. Or bumper, throw through. Go up, catch it, go down, boop, boop. I have no idea. fast. You have faith? I don't know, man. I don't know, man! What's up, Gilbert? It's starting to feel a lot like, uh, what is it, 7C? Where the pain really started? Oh, too early. I mean, we'll get it. We'll get it, right? It's just a matter of, you know, putting it all together. Nice. Oh. 
I like tweaked my toes somehow. What the heck? But no, for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. Believe! I guess this is what it means to truly beat the game, right? The true end. Yeah, we're probably just gonna play Mario 64 after this, I'm gonna be honest. I don't- I don't- I don't know if I wanna play <laughs> Grand Poo World tonight. Ah! Are you alright, Madeline? We're so close, but it feels impossible. Come on, just a few more tries. We can do this. Motivation. Yeah, we'll play some Mario 64. Start working on that. Determination. Let's -a go. When you're out of everything to play, really? Don't worry, don't worry, Sodium. Star will finish it for you. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah, no doubt. Yo, Sex Rex. Oh, you know, I don't, you know, I don't know what gave it away. I don't know, I don't, I don't know what gave away that you're an Undertale fan. I really couldn't tell. <laughs> hey, uh. <sighs> this will take a very long time. That's the only thing you wanted to, you wanted to be dedicated to. Hey, that's fair. That's fair. I've beaten SM64. I've never gotten all the stars, which is what I'm planning on doing. I'm planning on getting all 120 stars. Dang it. 
But I guess I gotta... I think I might have an extra boost there. I need to kind of just wait. I need to kind of hang out. <clears throat> I think it's probably what I'm not doing. Yeah, it's definitely it. Oh my gosh! We're getting there though, I guess. <clears throat> Yeah, hopefully everybody's had a good Saturday or Sunday now. <laughs> blue raspberry sour gum. I don't think I've ever had blue raspberry sour gum. I like sour things, but I'm surprised I haven't had that yet. Blue raspberry is pretty good. to hit that with the up boost before I grab it the first time. Like, for sure. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh. Oh, missed it. Sans eye blue. Basically telling me it tastes like water? I don't know. I'm not gonna even venture and guess at what this tastes like. I'm assuming blue raspberry and they just added sour. So pretty okay. I think I have to go upright then? So I don't get as much height? I was supposed to get rid of the uh, jellyfish. Dust mixed with, mixed with icing sugar? <laughs> what are you eating? <laughs> That's not healthy. That doesn't sound good. The Surgeon General definitely says it's a bad idea.
dust and icing sugar. That sounds horrible. See you later. I mean, you are correct. Dust does taste like yucky. So it's just funny that, like, at the end of, like, an eight-hour level already... <laughs> they put another lo super long ending... So you could suffer more. vertical section, just what I wanted for Christmas. Ugh, oh, my god. Why? Why do you hate me, game? <laughs> this, is, this game is suffering, basically. I'm not supposed to be playing Kaizo. What's up, Star? This game is literally suffering. Yo, Sessions, how you doing? Did you hear Blue the fast news? No, I haven't. Rip. I think you're not telling me. Toe is mad. I don't even know why. Are you talking about Sonic? You can't do it! I mean, like most things, you know, we'll get it. It's just a matter of time and if my sanity lasts. Basically how it boils down. Never give up. I can't amend that, oh my! <laughs> I was going to laugh if that worked. I hope not, Sackett. That would really suck. I'm not giving up. Come on. We never give up in this chat. It's either, it's either his channel, it's either Adam Sandler or 
Sonic or Sans, who knows anymore. Ugh. Chaotic, just chaotic evil? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think chat I think chat's alignment in general is at least chaotic neutral. At least chaotic neutral. Oh. Up the boost, Cocker. No, I just haven't, I haven't seen a whole bunch of Adam Sandler movies. Like, the movies I have seen are good, but... Probably Mr. Deeds. Mr. Deeds would like Happy Gilmore. Hmm, interesting. I mean, like, there's only a couple of Sonic games I'm interested in, like, on actually playing. So, like, Sonic 2 and 3, I think that's about it. Other than that, like, eh. I don't think I'm going to play any of the 3D Sonics. Yeah, I like the more old school Sonic games. Holy guacamole. I want to see if I can check this up part. I can't check it. That's so dumb. I have actually no idea how long the last song game was. Like, I think my first ever Sonic game was Sonic 1 with All Dead. Like, it's been... Like, originally when I played it. So, like, probably like 2013, 2014. I've never heard of it second.
Oh, gosh. I mean, no. It's not. Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here with your fan theories. Jeez. It's all a fever dream. Rick rolling people in chat. Is it that time of night again? <laughs> Jeez Louise. I totally forgot how hard this end of this game was. I mean, I don't even know how I forgot that, but I did. Thank you for going down. That was a nice dream. Yo, what's up, insane guy? A really long one? Seriously? I gotta do this every attempt? And that's not even all of it either. Like, really? It's just getting like, stupid level. This is seriously getting to the point where it's stupid. If there's not a midway somewhere, like I'm legit about to just turn this off and be like, I'm done with it. Cause like, 
It's getting to the point where it's not fun. Like, just because you can make a level long doesn't mean you should. You know? Like, this level's already long as shit. Like, come on. Make another level or something. Don't put it all in one. To try and fool the people that there's only one. I'm getting- I'm getting a little frustrated, like... It's very annoying. Like, we'll see, but like, if I have to do the up-down section every single time, like... I'm seriously just gonna turn it off at some point. Yeah, if there's not a midway, like, I'm seriously just gonna turn it off. Because, like, you have to do this whole thing, and then you have to do the up-down, and it's like, okay, and you have to do the end, and hope to God you don't mess up anywhere. I don't know, that's... that's silly. Like, one of the major factors for determining how difficult a level is, is how long it is. That's what makes, like, for example, like, the People's Castle so difficult, is because it's so long. You have to do so many things in a row perfectly without any checkpoints. That's what makes it incredibly difficult. This, each individual level isn't that hard. The sum of all the levels is hard. <sighs> I mean, don't be surprised if I don't play your games, Akati. I can't create a save state now. It's like I want to beat it, but this is like going to leave me with a bad taste in my mouth, and that's not good. So you go to like, wow, this game is good, to like, wow, this game is kind of bad. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I'm getting frustrated. I'm getting salty at it. Like, it's like. You can't even check. Right, but it's like... That's so dumb. Like, I want to beat it, it's just... This is like giving me a bad taste in my mouth. Like, you can't even look at the up one part. So, like, all that's blind, and then you have to, like, do it every single time is going to be maddening. Yeah. This just feels like one of those Kaiser creators that is like, Oh, I did it with save states, you should be able to do it. You know, or something like that. Or I did it, you can do it. So we make like the stupidest hack possible. I don't know, maybe some people enjoy this level of difficulty. I mean, you can say the same thing about, like, you know, Kaizo Axe, right? I guess this just isn't for everybody? I don't know. Yeah, I'm not surprised, Twig. Like, it's, it's so long! Like, why? Why not split it up into two rooms? Right? Or three rooms, even. The first part? Oh, the next room is an up part? Okay, cool. And then the last part is just getting the last thing. Like, really? Is that hard to do? You don't want to wait guests so you can't eat your chips you bought today like a dummy? Yo, rip. Well, I mean, it's like, you know, I want to beat it. I've already put in, like, 
you know, tons of time in this level. It just, this feels like a kick in the balls, you know? It's like, oh yeah, here, take this long level you're gonna spend several hours on. Good luck. After you've already spent several hours on this entire level. I don't know. Feels bad, dude. I get ticket if I do. I don't. I don't. I can't afford any more tickets. From the public morality police. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this may that may be the play. It's just like at some point, like we'll just come back to it. At some point in the future. Like, whenever that may be, who knows? Too many grindy, I mean, like, grindy SMW level. Like, and then this is grindy as heck. Too much grinding today. Right? This is, I mean, this is supposed to be casual, but <laughs> I went above and beyond here. <laughs> and that's mainly because I was like, I was genuinely like, oh, let's, you know, finish it up. Let's beat the game, you know? Let's get it. I'm just being, I'm being real salty right now, so I'm gonna stop. We got this. We'll get it. Yeah, I know, but it don't look good. All right, top section again. Let's go. Ouch. You never get salty? Yeah, I know, Cog. I've already been at this for a hot minute already. I've already- I've already had my salt rant about it. Like... Bad game design. And IMO. <laughs> I'm sorry, it is. Like, it- so, is there no midway in this level? At all? Or in this section? Yeah, you must be sodium chloride logic. There is no midway in this section, wow. What generous devs. I've seen midways for less, I don't- I don't get why they decided not to put one here. I don't get it. Also, I don't get the whole, oh, we can let you check out the whole level, except for the up part. Don't look at the up part.
It's, yeah, it's pretty dumb. It's slow. It's precise. There's no midway. I don't know how long it is. It's madness. This is Sparta. I mean, I don't think you consider going up a breather there. I guess from all like the jellyfish shenanigans, sure. eating dinner that was made like eight hours ago <laughs> it's a uh, basically cabbage and like sausage and rice it's good it's really really good like really basic like dinner that's really good well 25 drawn eye shaman running in storm one that's me, dude. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, it's just really simple, you know, really simple, cheap, easy meal. Get too, get too greedy here. I felt I, I felt the need to press up, which led me die. That's pretty cool. Rip. I think I'm gonna give this till like 12:30. My time, so 30 more minutes, and then like if we're not making much progress, I'm just gonna call it. <laughs> That's probably the best thing to do, to be honest. Thunderdome, bow, bow, bow.
Ugh. Heck. But I mean, like, if you only have limited time to play, like, level 25 isn't that bad. I mean, for like two weeks ish. I mean, it's definitely a blow up. You're definitely not gonna make a uh, a TBC run there, but. And if you got nothing else to do, I mean, it makes sense, right? Level another character or whatever. Level 25. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't read the other thing. Partner's working tonight. This is so dumb. <sighs> okay, I lied. I lied. I'm done with it. I'm over it. Legitimately over it. All right. <laughs> I'm swapping over to uh, Mario 64. I'm legitimately over Celeste. <laughs> that level... <sighs> it's too long. How long have I been playing this game? Like, straight up. Well, let's check. Let's check how many hours I put in this game already. Right? It's not fun. It's not fun at all right now. I've spent ten and a half hours in this level. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done with this game. It's fine. I'm out. <laughs>